it is possible to import text from files saved in HTML format. But for this function to work, the file must have the correct heading and cannot have too much extra formatting. This is because this function is primarily intended for importing files that were originally exported from Redman. To export text, go to File, Export, Text of Review. The new dialog box will ask you where you want to save the review. I'm going to save my on my desktop and I will save it with the name of this review. You can save it as a HTML file or a text file. I'm going to save mine as HTML so I can edit it later in a Word document. So click on save. Now let's go back to my desktop. Here is the review. If we open it up, this is how it looks like, the full review in HTML format. However, I'm not able to edit it in this format, so in order to edit it, I will have to open it up in a Word document. I open up my Word and go to File, Open, go to my desktop and find my HTML file. Here it is and click on open. Now here we have the full review opened up in a word. As you can see in this file, it has all the headings just like the Revman file did. It has background, objectives and methods, all the appropriate headings. I can now do my editings in this document, but if I want to import this document back into my Revman file later, I will have to save this in HTML format. And now I'm going to show you how it's done. For demonstration purpose, I'm going to replace all the contents in abstract with X's to make it obvious. OK, I have finished my editing and now I'm going to save this as an HTML file. So I go to File, Save As, Revman Import and save it as web page. Click on Save. Now I go back to my Revman and I'm going to import those changes into my Revman file. So let's go to File, Import, Text of Review. This will start the Import Text Wizard. Just follow the wizard and click on Next. Find the HTML file that we just saved, which is on my desktop and it's here. Choose it and click on Open. Content of that file is now displayed in this dialog box. Click on Next. You can import everything in that file, or you can choose only a few sections to import. Any sections that you don't want to import, just untick them and leave everything else that you wish to import ticked. When I click on Finish, the editings that we just did in the Word document will be imported. It tells me that I imported 27 sections. Here it is, all the exits that we replaced in the Word document is now implemented in this Revman file.